Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Can we just do it on you? Or do we get it on some skeleton knights? It's not as impactful on them that it, as it is on these guys, though. Do I just want... Dark gift skeletons? It's so good on infantry units. But getting the extra power is also really good. And we do use the knights a lot more than we use the warriors. So I think I might just want the knights. You're already amazing, so I don't need you to have it. But it's gonna put you over the top. Yeah, let's put it on the knights, actually. I think that's the way to go. Ooh, we lost a lot of them, but luckily we do have a tent, so <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's try not to lose too many units. And we're fighting dwarves, which hmm, I don't know if that's good or not. They're very defensive. We did have a very good dwarf fight earlier, but... I do have a lot of cannons and stuff, which is not... Oh, wait, we should really get into formation. But yeah, I don't think the cannons are very healthy for us. But we do have a lot of bats, so we can definitely get into cannons. So yeah. Let's just park you over there. We can keep you a little bit more central, I guess. Uh, keep some bats over there. Keep you a little bit more central. Yeah, they probably might have some cannons over here and here. Or maybe in the forest. Yeah, but you can definitely get to the forest if we need to. Yeah, okay. I think this is fine. Oh, lots of helicopters. And at least it's flame cannons. Flame cannons aren't that scary. Well, they are scary. But only if they get to shoot. And uh, their range is pretty shit. Yeah, as long as we keep, like, our stuff over here, which we can charge past this. <laughs> we got really good charges, especially if... Oh, we should have widened you. Ah, oh, whatever. But yeah, we can charge really far if we need to. So, just let them come. Let them come. Oh, yeah, we can... We can flank charge you there. But let's just keep passing. They're gonna flame us. It's gonna hurt. Oh, five... Oof, well, good thing we got extra wounds on you. But yeah, I think if we just park you over here, that's gonna be a flank charge. Actually, if we just kind of block this, because I don't think... I don't think these tend to... to... Um, charge stuff. It kind of just range unit so if we just block them from coming in here I don't think he can reach here and turn around and this should be a flank charge so yeah I think I think that's fine let's just move over there yeah so you can't reach us here you're not gonna be, well you probably won't charge us either so I think that's fine yeah we gotta get in on to fight on you might actually get the Dwarf war or skeleton warriors, although probably want to fight the miners with them. Because the miners are pretty like on par with us. They're slightly better. Yeah, they're better. <laughs> I'm not gonna kid myself thinking that they you know, that we can have them fight on equal grounds. Well we can probably get you fast enough to get into infernal cannons. And the, or we just get the bats to go into the cannons, actually. Yeah, so I guess we just move up with you a little bit. I don't think there's anything in particular we're going to get you to fight with this turn that we want you to fight. And I think if we just park you over here. Wait, wait. Actually, what's your charge range? Not amazing. But if we park you, like, there, you can't reach. Oh, that's not even a flank charge. And I don't want you to get blown up. Alright. So, do we just... I guess we go up with you. Because we can buff you up here. 
And we need to if we're gonna reach that. So yeah, buff that up. That reaches. They're not gonna get to shoot us here. So that's fine. We can... Ow. Stop rolling so well on your flaming. You bastards. Alright, and we do need to be a little bit careful with you, but... You can definitely take on a flying machine. Speaking of flying machines, though... I think we send you in over here. Question is... Yeah, you... Your charge range is far, so we're fine just setting it up like there. And right, <laughs> need to check that we're out of cannon range. But yeah, we can we can get in over there. That way we can get you some unholy vigor. Get you into a good position. Because I think you're gonna try to kill this. Bats try to get the cannons and you try to get into the miners or one of the berserkers. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Okay, you can definitely get in there now. Oh, but now you can't... Right. That's okay. We can... We can change these plans up. We can get you like that. You can attack either of these. Okay, you're done. <laughs> now we just send you up there. That's a flank charge to start. And it's gonna be fine. And now we get to get you in there, we get you in there. We're gonna be feeling good. And we go like... I guess we can sandwich you, ignore the flying machine, explode the miners. And have the Berserkers fight the Skeleton Warriors, so they don't go into these guys? I think that's fine, actually. I think that's gonna turn out... Yeah, 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 that, that might be okay. Because if we kill either of these, then you can intercept. Alright, let's go with what we already have decided. That's not gonna change. Send you in like so. Send you in there. But the question is, do we send you in there, or do we send you in there? That's pretty much a guaranteed kill on this machine. But I think we can just explode the miner, so I want to take this opportunity to just absolutely annihilate these miners. So I think that's, that's some pretty good charges. I think I like that a lot. You still fit. Don't try to lie to me. That's a, that's a lot of trumpets. You went up there. Oh, hello. Well, that's a movement. You got in over there. All right. You haven't moved yet. Okay. So, let's get an unholy vigor on you. Oh, you're going after the bats. Oh, you son of a bitch. All right. Well, we can get you over... Oh, can we actually get you in the... No. So close, though. But if we kill you, you can go into the Berserkers. You go and stop these. And if we manage to route you, I think you can go into the Berserkers. Okay, so if this goes as, it, as I hope, then this is gonna be amazing. <laughs> That's a good start. That's a bad continuation. Save. Please route. Yes! Because that means we can rear charge these berserkers. We hopefully kill this cannon. Yeah. No? No. Alright. But well, we can route it. Yeah! Dead. Excellent. Now we actually took some damage there. Reroll. Thank you. The Lord is dead. And the flying machine is okay. But that's still an A or a four. Oh, dang it. Damn, damn, dang it. <laughs> that ruins the whole plan. Oh, and you saved like a champ. All right. Well, you're dead in that case. That's unfortunate. That's a lot of dead, dead miners, though. That's, that's nice. 
Yeah, that's a lot of dead miners. Enough dead miners that I can comfortably say that these guys are mulch. <laughs> okay, so at least we can save a lot of our guys from certain doom. And at least it's, it is just fell bats that are getting shafted here. And we can get these guys rear charging the dwarf berserkers. So it's fine. It's not great, but it's fine. I'm okay with it. And now we just need to kill this because stupid dwarf and his stupid flying machine. And his stupid. Stupid. <laughs> but that's all of our movements because we're all still in combat. Oh. Uh, wait, what saved? You saved. Okay, that's, that's fine. Who cares? Uh, yes. Let's roll it back. See if this goes better. No. <laughs> God, I love cruelty. It's wonderful. Alright, so... Yeah, okay, you're still alive. You're holding your own against a, uh, against a dragon. That's admirable. When you're one wound away. If there weren't a bunch of dwarf berserkers in you, <laughs> you would have been great. Alright, well... Three is not good enough. That's, yeah, that's gonna be some dead bats. At least they get to fight back, so that's nice. Alright, that's pretty good. We lose some warriors, but we do some really good damage. That's definitely a route, though. We might be able to get in there. Maybe. Okay, you're dead at least. That feels good. You're gonna be so good once you're healed up. It's gonna be great. Okay, so... Yeah, you go in there at the very least. And I think we'll let you do your thing here. Yeah, that's all of our charges, I think. Because we're gonna get these into better positions. Ow. Yeah, there's nothing we can do about that. But we only lose two of them. That's not, not that bad. So, get... Out of the way, please. There we go. We get... Okay, wait, 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 wait. We need to give you unholy vigor. Oh, right. Right, damn it. Fuck, I just looked at the range. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, that hurts. Alright, well, we get you in there at the very least. And you rallied. Alright. Because I... I keep making these mistakes with the uh, Inferno Cannons. Okay, well that's fine. This is okay. Our most important units are still nice and healthy. Well, you're not, but you're gonna get... Like, two more uh, from this healing. You're gonna get at least one back from passive, and then four back from the tent. So you should be able to heal up just all the way. Just need to keep you healthy and you healthy. Bats doesn't matter. Bats we can heal up no problem. And uh, that's alright, please route. Yes, good. Good, good, good. So, let's start finishing things off. Um, I'm actually gonna keep you... Try to keep you alive here. So, we're gonna ignore you for now. If you come back, then the White Lord should... Be, we, we gotta be able to get a damage here. So, we can continue on into you. So, that's fine. So, these are our charges. We're gonna get you over to the flying machine. And we're gonna get you to finish off some Berserkers here. There we go. Alright. It was a little bit iffy there for a while, but I think we got this. Yeah, of course you rally. Not <laughs> 10? <laughs> yeah, alright. Well, I mean, roll a 10 and you somehow still stand. <laughs> God damn it, dwarf ha dwarves have good leadership, man. Alright, keep these occupied while we murder these. 
and we can go on to these next turn. That's fine. Good, you're dead. Thank you, finally. Man, you are... You are a problem. Mostly because dwarves came to help. Or specifically dwarf berserkers came to help. And just... Made... Slop out of my bats. So get you in there, get you in there, and get you in there. And now we're gonna wipe the table off. Is there anything that's actually routed off that we haven't had to actually just like turn into mincemeat? I think we have, have been forced to kill every single unit in this fight. Which, uh, yeah, that's rough. <laughs> but you're routing. Excellent. Those guys got, got away. Some very lucky few. But everyone else is dead. <laughs> so there was four alive dwarves that got away after this battle. But that's pretty good. I'm fine with it. I wish I could have killed those dwarves too. But this is how it's gotta be. So yeah, you'll get healed up in the tent now. You're not gonna be able to level though. That's unfortunate. But you'll get a level. You did get a level now. And uh, yeah, we probably just give you skill. Skill is really valuable because four is such a good break. Oh, dang it. I wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> dang it. All right. Well, you get a heal. Because you, you're gonna need two more heals before you're full. But that's fine. You? I mean, the skill is really nice. But I think I just want more attacks with you. It's... Mm, that's gonna be four extra attacks per turn. Is that better than skill four? In, mm, it's gonna... Hmm. <laughs> I just take attack. I'm not gonna sit here and do math. Uh, I want more dice. Yes, well, yeah, okay, I could have taken money on that one too. I want more dice, not more math. So <laughs> this is fine. Uh, take the money because we're going into a tent and I have been ignoring that. We should have just... Ooh, movement speed is very nice. So yeah, you get two more heals in the tent. You're gonna be fine. And you're gonna be fully healed. As long as we heal you now. Yeah. So we're gonna be tip-top shape when we get to the boss. Glad we're taking a tent. And we're not buying anything. I just wanna... I just want... Shields and lances on all of our guys. I want those charges to be... Like... Fat. <laughs> and uh, we want extra attacks. Flame tongue is fine. War banner, meh. I do like Curse Standard. I don't know if it's actually better, but it's so satisfying to have one, that one round with like 30 attacks, and I love it. Finding Chaos, so Mist Banner doesn't matter. Movement Speed is nice. Banner of Valor does nothing for Undead. Why is that even here? <laughs> no. That shouldn't be there. So yeah, either Cure Standard or, or just one Banners of Mist. Nah, I like Cure Standard. And it's not gonna be, it's not as good on these. So I just want it on you. And fine, just give me a Banner of Valor, you dumb, <laughs> stupid game. Alright, whatever. Everybody heals up. And you level up. I thought you were gonna level. I, th I thought you were two out of three. Alright, well, get you another attack. You're very good at fighting. We never got all of the... No, wait. No, oh, right. They got mixed up for some reason. This is the main guy. No, you finally got extra attacks. Now you're up to five, thanks to the extra attack we just bought. So you grab that. I just want you to be full. I don't think you're gonna get anything good from that level. So, yeah. Heal, heal, heal. 
feeling healthy, going into the final fight. And right, before we go into the final fight, gotta remember to widen. And what are you doing? No, 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 no. Nothing like that. There's so many skeletons. Love it. Widen you, and you're as wide as you go. Yeah. So we want some thick uh, cav charges here. We got our tar pit, and we got our flankers. Well, you're also flankers, but you might have to not flank. <laughs> we'll see. Yes. Let's go. So yeah, this is... This is gonna be kind of rough. Because they are good in combat. So you so you go in the middle. We go with bats on flanks. Probably put you over there. I think we go... Hmm. I think we go with you here. We can send you up here if you have to, but you can also flank, which is fine. So I guess we go like that. And there's just a shaman over there. Okay, so pass through. Pass. That's fine. Don't think we can fit there, which is a drawback of you. But you can fit. So let's... Let's flank charge these guys. And... Hmm. I want to be able to get you out of there too. Yeah, if we go like that. That's fine. Because now we can still charge you there and we can get these out of this little pocket here. And let's zoom out a little bit so we can actually see. So these are going to be scary. They got Abyssal Knights, which are also going to be scary. So their defense 5, plus Abyssal Armor is plus 1 to damage save, so effectively defense 6. Like these guys. So yeah, these guys are... Ours are kind of better, but they got 3 attacks. Oh, Jesus. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, well, we'll just move up with you. Get ready. We will just park you. Okay. We're just gonna move up a little bit with you. My charge the Abyssal Knights. Oh, actually. Oh, come on. Actually, we can we can reach you here, can't we? Yes, we can charge you there as long as we just pop that on So now we reach you so we get a flank charge there might just send you in for the heck of it Just curse standard right away and just have at it See how that works out Okay, never mind <laughs> damn it <laughs> I should have thought of that All right. Well in that case our dark gift cab are gonna go in to the Abyssal Knights. And I guess you go into the Ibex Warriors and just route them off. Yeah. Set you up like that. And... Yeah, you can hang out right there. You're gonna fly with your dragon here, probably. No? Ooh, that hurts. It's fine. We're okay. In that case, we are just gonna get you. Oh, we don't even have to be that close. We can just go up. Well, let's make this easier for us. Because we can just get you over there. We can charge you definitely. We get a flank charge. But before we do, flame them gonna be three ups but we got a wound I'll take it any wound we can get on abyssal knights I am there for so yeah I think that's gonna be a good first turn of combat so let's start with well I guess let's start with you and we go in with you 
And we get a flank charge on you. And we get you. Actually, I want to get you in here because I think we can absolutely destroy these guys. And then you have an excellent angle to keep going into these guys. So let's do that. You can go into the Ibex Warriors. You go into the Shaman. And you go into the Chariot. I think that's gonna be good. What abilities do you have? Okay, only Demonic Possession and Wild Form. Okay, so they don't have any, like, faction-wide buffs, as they can have sometimes. So, we're just dealing with personal buffs. And I don't think we need the, <laughs> the Curse Standard here, because the Dread Knights are gonna do all the work. So that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna skip through. We're gonna be fine. You're gonna have to take on a goat with wild form, which isn't great, but it's gonna be what it's gonna be. You might get flank charged here, but again, it's gonna be what it's gonna be. But yeah, <laughs> super dead lord. The white lord is gonna be amazing anytime we fight a lord. And I, I think it's funny that... Um, that... Dragon mounts, when the Lord dies, it's just wings and a tail left. <laughs> it's all there is to him. Ooh, that's no good. Well, we still win, and we killed one. I guess that's what's important right now. And we absolutely slaughter these. So yeah, you can get into the Axemen now if we want. Got some good damage with the Lord, and got some good damage with the Cav. So, you're routing. Very nice. Okay, two damage. Or equal. Alright, a draw. Take a draw. We only need to do three more damage. So that's fine. And you're dead. Ex excellent. But, we are gonna get... Nope! Ha <laughs> ha! You didn't, you didn't plan on my cutting strategy of uh, dying with one of the bats, so you couldn't reach us. So yeah, get you in there. You're gonna get flank charged, which isn't optimal, but it is what it is. Yeah, finish these off. You're just gonna turn around and get into the knights. And you're just gonna sweep through here. If you hold, we kill these. Then we get to box you, which is going to be pretty good. We're going to curse standard in the rear of these Abyssal Knights. Alright, you have multiple wild, wild forms. Rude. Alright, let's go to the other side of these guys. It's going to be fine. And just yeah, so that we don't have any abilities that I'm forgetting about. No, okay. That's fine. So, we do still have three attacks, that is pretty high powered. We only lost by one, which is fine. So, with the sandwich, I think you're just dead. And three damage. Oh, so close, so close. Come on, stay. Damn you bats. You cowardly little shits. Okay, well that's gonna be enough to rout. So now we get into the Abyssal Warriors. Yeah, yeah, good. And that's pretty good. That's very good. Okay, yeah, we got this. This is on lockdown right now, because the Abyssal Warriors are getting their ass kicked. Turns out dragons are pretty good. <laughs> Ooh, they got one left. Well, they're gonna keep routing. And I think we can leave these be, because I think you're gonna have to go and deal with this shop. And if we can even get past this, because this is impassable. So we're getting blocked in both of these passages. Alright. Well, get in these. It's gonna be fine. Don't think we're gonna care about that. Because you might still rally. We do need to fight these. And... Oh. Okay, don't rally then. Oh, well, we can go down here and fight. Yeah, 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 this is fine. So, go down. Oh, this might just 
tell me that there's no path, but we're gonna try anyway. I think this might be okay. Yeah, I think we can get that. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's these guys that rallied. All right, you know what? Let's let's stop that. <laughs> oh, everyone is rallying. All right. I guess that's fine. Curse standard. I want these dead. <laughs> I want their families and their pets dead. Well, not the pets. I'm gonna leave the pets alive. That's just the right thing to do. And we still didn't actually kill them, but they rout and explode. And we can't, can't quite... Oh wait, that's our own. I don't want to charge my own knights in the back. Alright, good saves. And... I think... I think they rout. <laughs> Very nice. And now we can box these axemen as well. The Dread Knight uh, Bone Dragon White Lord combo. So yeah, get in there. Uh, we, oh, we can charge there. Excellent. And now you're just gonna have to go find somewhere to fight. Probably these Ibex warriors. Because everything else should be dead. Because there's one HP, one thing, and this guy is probably gonna kill the shaman too. Yeah, let's... Uh, let's just send you up and around. See if we need to kill these abyssal warriors. We do. So you... Wait, wait. Not yet. You get to go and fight these Ibex warriors. Uh, yeah, that doesn't matter. So... This, oh, they actually did some good saving, but they should be absolutely slaughtered. And I guess we can just continue on into these guys, because, yeah, there's... <laughs> they don't even get a chance to roll. I mean, it wouldn't have helped, because 14. <laughs> so, yeah, we can just kill the Abyssal Warriors there. And we don't get to kill the Lord. That's okay. Cause doesn't matter, because you're dead. Very nice. All right, so you're dead. You're dead. And uh, yeah, let's just. Well, actually, this way we can get you over here. We get the skeleton warriors in ready to fight. Yes. Oh, let's make sure we get over. And we're gonna finish this. We're gonna finish this properly. Although they might just route here. Might just route because of that. <laughs> I kinda hope they don't because I wanna kill these Ibex warriors as well. Oh, they're routing. Boo! Cowardly chaos! Come back here! I wanna finish you off. Alright, that was pretty good. Ended up with a pretty good army there by the end. We could have had some mortars, some uh, city. Some city guards and a sorceress on a manticore as well, which would have been nice, but we're going all undead today. So that was great. Oh, so many good kills. These guys are great. Uh, you didn't, weren't with us that long, so you did good for how long you were with us. The bats did fine. 107 kills overall. Pretty good. Skeleton Warriors, it's fine. They're, they are cannon fodder and they still got some kills. They lost more models than they killed, but they heal really well, so they're fine. These did fine. We also got them by the end of Act 2. Right? Yeah, Branox Plaguebound was his retinue. Because that's Branox. So yeah, these actually... Yeah, we got these... Like, middle Act 2, while you got end of Act 1, so... You got pretty bad kills for what you what you was. But the White Lords did pretty good. Dragon, amazing. Got it early, so it had time to do some amazing things. So yeah. They did pretty good. I... I do really like the Dead Nations. But I feel like I mostly just play the cab. <laughs> And the the 
Like, all the fast things. The White Guard's good, but I feel like the Skeletons are too... Too cannon foddery. I feel like the Cav is what does... What's good in this faction. So yeah, this is definitely a Cav faction, which makes sense. They're based on the Vampire Counts, and they're also a Cav faction. So yeah, they're pretty fun. I like them. Not my favorites, but they're fun. So... Next might be Dwarves. I have taken some time to unlock all of their stuff. Well, I did a run. <laughs> I did a run and unlocked all of their stuff. So we're also on difficulty 5, so that's pretty good. I am still going to like play one of these off video, I think. So we can do difficulty 7 on them or these soon. But I have had uh, had a a well suggestion or request for the dwarves, and I think it's time for them again because uh, the dwarves were the first faction I ever played on the channel and first faction I ever played at all in this game. No, wait, that's not true. I played the greenskins first, but I died. <laughs> it was the first win I had. Um, so I think it's time for the dwarves again. Yeah, so I think next might be the dwarves, unless uh, unless there's some some people want me to do something else, but I think it's gonna be dwarves, and I don't know which one will do. I think I like the foreman the best among the ones I well I played all of them. Actually, did I? No, wait, I bought a ranger captain. I don't know if I play. Yeah, I don't think I played the ranger captain. I've had a ranger captain. I played the engineer and the foreman. So yeah, might play the ranger captain. The rangers are pretty good, so might do that. That's pretty neat. So yeah, we're gonna probably play the dwarves next, and I think I'm gonna play the ranger captain. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this run, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.